This morning, the family and friends of a Nassau County teenager who died in a plane crash last week are remembering her. The community gathered for a sunrise service this morning in Fernandina Beach, remembering 18-year-old Alexis George. The Fernandina Beach High School graduate and her flight instructor, David Catino, were killed when their plane crashed into the St. Mary's River last week. News for Jack's reporter Jennifer Reddy joining us live this morning. Jen, right behind you, there was a vigil. Uh, there is a celebration of life also coming up in the coming days. Good morning. There is this this morning was one of several events and services that is planned this week to pay tribute to 18 year old Alexis George. And as you mentioned, this service took place right here behind me, right near the pier here in Fernandina Beach, and it wrapped up just in the last hour. It was a very private and moving service for her family and friends. This is video from the service earlier this morning. Dozens of people came down here by the pier to honor and remember Alexis George. She's described by her father as a teenager who loved life and had a passion for flying. During the service, a plane also flew overhead. George and her flight instructor, David Catino, were on the plane last Friday when it went down in the St. Mary's River. Troopers say the plane had some type of malfunction, but the NTSB is investigating the exact reason why it crashed. Catino was a military veteran who also was very active in the animal rescue community. Now there will also be a vigil that will be held on Friday night at the Fernandina Beach Airport that is slated to start around 8 o'clock. We have all of this information about the different services on our website, newsforjacks.com. Jennifer Reddy, Channel 4, The Local Station.